Thank you for joining me today. We are going to make a chicken stew. It's all nice and cold still outside, so this will just help hit things just right. We're going to start by browning our chicken. Put a little bit of oil in the pan. How many of you have ever had a chicken stew? It's usually not a bad way to go, just make it a little something different. We will get the chicken added in here. I am using a couple thighs because thighs do just seem to work so much better when making anything that's going to need to be a kind of a broth. I am going to end up taking these off the bone after everything cooks down because part of this will be for the flavor itself. Well, we will come back here in just a moment. All right, we're going to get these flipped over and get some onion added in. just to help add some flavor to the base of the mix itself so that way you got layers of flavor going on so we're going to let this get ground up on the other side of the chicken don't let the onions get cooked down below and then we'll be right back all right chicken's getting a good amount of color to it onions have caramelized up a bit Let's just move this all along. I am going to add a little bit of foil into this because it just adds a little extra flavor. Now I'm going to go ahead and add my water. We're going to take and boil this up for a little while. Get this chicken all cooked down, and then we'll be back to add our veggies. Okay, this has been boiling for about an hour now. I did add some rosemary in here. I'm going to pull the chicken out and get my potatoes put in. I have to add a little bit more water to this. chicken chance to cool a little so we can get it tore apart. And we're probably going to let that get to boil at least for about five minutes or so. Alright, I'm going to add the chicken back in. Now I got some mushrooms and some more just cut up onion because I want some actual taste of onion. Then I'm going to add some egg noodles. Because why not? You know? Let's get this a stir. And we'll take and uh, we'll be back in about amount of time for the egg noodles to be done and check on it. All right, I gave this a taste. I'm going to add a little bit more black pepper. This has been close to 10 minutes. That's about the package directions for the noodles. Now I'm going to add a little bit of a flour water mixture to help thicken this up.
we will let this come to get all thickened up and we'll be right back. All right, you guys, this is all done and ready to eat. I got mushrooms, onions, potatoes, noodles, chicken. You know, it's all about what you got in the fridge. Use what you have. There is no set recipe. There is no recipe going to be in the description. If you have any questions about it, feel free to ask them down below. Anyways, hope you enjoy this video, and I'll see you again next time.